Hey guys, welcome back to the Auto Hunt. Today is another DIY day. This is take threes of my DIYs. I've done the Maverick with the lettering and the tailgate assist. I've done my wife's car with the wipers. And today we're gonna to be putting on the front grills of my Porsche Boxster S. So I sourced mine for a company called the Radiator Grill Store. Now this is not a paid sponsorship. However, I will tell you that the first set of grills that I put on the car were on the sides on the intakes and they looked phenomenal they fit phenomenal and literally took me about three minutes per side super super easy to do so right here you can see that the car doesn't have any radiator grills in it whatsoever my hand goes all the way in and that means those radiators back there could get pretty dinged up with rocks and debris so if you take these really cool grills that I got from the radiator grill store. These are gonna fit right inside here behind these. So how do we get them in without damaging anything? So you can see right here, these are where the tabs are underneath here, and there's one right underneath here. So what I've done is I've already released it because I'm doing this with one hand, and you pull this out like so. So what you'll do is you give this a hard pull, and I've already kind of loosened it up just because, again, I'm working one-handed. This will, these get that put on the ground nice and safely. So line them up on the outside of the car just to see what they're going to look like. These come in two pieces, this piece and this piece of car, and you slide it into the grill itself. And you can see it just slides in ever so gently. Right tie wraps on here. You slide it in, like so. And now they're both secure behind where the radiator is. And all you want to do is put these nice little winglets back on. So this one goes in first, and then this one goes in second. Well, there it is, all completed. Um, I took these off completely, the strings off completely. They were a little loose up on the front. Uh, however, on the other side, I tried something a little bit different. I left these completely attached and they're not as loose. And it came out, I think, looking a little bit better. Um, the other side's not gonna fly off, but if you really wanna kind of not have too much hassle, uh, just take the first two clips on, on either side from here, this spot right here in the middle. Leave this one, don't mess with that one. Otherwise, you're not gonna get a tight fit unless you're like really good at this stuff. And I'm not. So uh, this has been the Auto Hound. If you like this type of content, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, it's about the drive.